I'm back. I'm getting ready to move to Iowa. Due to circumstances. But it's going to get better. I swear. I hope. Even though I still haven't seen my kids in over a year. Since then I've had a kiddo pass away. Another one. It hasn't been the easiest for me. But I do have now a little, little, little girl. And she's freaking amazing. She just lights up the world with one little smile. I swear to God, little fairies pop out. But I am thrilled that it's getting better. Even the move is very good. So we don't exactly have jobs lined up yet, but I'm at work right now. Pretty much almost done with the stuff I need to do. I'm going to go do the things I need to do as far as my job's related, but what I'm trying to say is, or what I'm trying to advise is never move to Beatrice, Nebraska, because their laws are not really effective. There's a man that's been with my children, which is a sex offender, for three years. CPS refuses to do anything about it. They're allowing him to walk up to the schools. They're letting him get away with it. He should have been already arrested by the time he walked up to the school because, to my understanding, the bylaws of a sex offender, they're not supposed to be 500 feet in front of a school, but he just gets to walk on up because they don't care. They'd rather put your children in danger knowing what he is. And on top of all, they ran off and got married. I don't know if there's any legal papers, but I'm still married to my wife. So, anybody got questions or answers that might actually help the instance? But my advice, don't move this way because it's so corrupt. It's so dangerous that nobody gives a shit. Pardon my French, but they just don't. They all want and pleading act like they care but it just doesn't work out that way but I'm hoping for a significant change in my life but I think tomorrow when I wake up from work I'll actually put some videos up of little Miss Becca and see how she's doing and see how well she reacts to the channel those of you that are sleeping, night all. And those of you that are just waking up, have a good day and God bless you and hopefully things go well.